A clerk here at this gas station says a man came running in with a baby in his arms and he was trying to hide. It's just upsetting. It's difficult to watch. I mean, it's just no regard uh, for human life or, or for the life of a child. The gun jamming or somehow malfunctioning is what may have saved his father's life and that of his seven-month-old baby. When Detroit police say this man tried to open fire on them inside a Valero gas station on Tyreman at Hubble early Sunday evening. Father's Day. The father uh, quickly, uh, once he observed it, lifted his arm up and, and fortunately pushed the gun away. He was able to get him outside of the gas station and lock the door. Police say this is a felonious assault and they released this surveillance video today in hopes that someone seeing it could help them identify the would-be shooter. Here he is approaching the gas station in his white tank top, tan bucket hat, and long khaki shorts. What you don't see until he's opening the door of the gas station is the gun he had tucked in his pants. Police say he's after the man holding the baby who the clerk says had just run inside to hide. So the dad came in here for safety? Yeah, he runs. He, he runs to hide in the gas stations, but he followed him. The dad manages to push the gun away. Thankfully, he and his baby were not shot. And here's a good look at the man with the gun, captured on video by green light cameras. We are asking that the public, if they are able to, or they know this individual, to call 1-800-SPEAK-UP. Then this afternoon, just a few blocks away, Detroit police took a person of interest into custody and then obtained a search warrant to look for the gun involved. As for a motive, Detroit police say the men had just had some sort of dispute. About a block away from this location there at Tyreman and the um, and Hubble, uh, he had encountered this individual. It appears they had some type of arg argument uh, unknown at this time. We still are early in the investigation and trying to uh, work backwards. Prior to running into the gas station, the man with the baby sustained some sort of injury to his arm, possibly stabbed or cut. It's definitely uh, upsetting and disturbing to watch uh, th th when you look at that video, especially on Father's Day. If you have any information on a suspect or this case, please contact Detroit 2nd Precinct. On the city's west side, Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News.